the type of history that is um, talked about. So yes, Toussaint is very much um, an icon in a lot of images of, um, of Haitian art. And in a way, it's as if nothing happened after that. Mm -hmm. You know? Like 1804 happened, and then nothing else in Haitian history. And I'm not suggesting that that is a bad thing. <laughs> but what I want us to think about is the kind of ways in which communities, and particularly communities of color, particularly black communities, particularly Haiti, gets a stymied and, 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 and lost in a particular historical moment and cannot be seen as a viable contemporary nation if we oftentimes continue to hearken back to history, not to disavow it by no means, but to think about um, other types of ways in which historical Haiti has factored so importantly in black diasporic cultural practices. Think about the Harlem Renaissance, right? Think about the wonderful ways in which Aaron Douglas, Jacob Lawrence, um, Louis Malo Jones went to Haiti during the Harlem Renaissance to seek cultural, aesthetic, artistic um, support, inspiration. But that is a history that we don't really know about. We don't really